The sweet spot? More like the stupid spot. Oh my god, this episode from the loud house sucks. Here are the reasons why I hate episode in my opinion. It's the night before the family road trip in the family van, also known as Vanzilla. Lincoln explains that he's preparing to stake the night out on the sweet spot, the only good seat in the car, as it protects him from the various inconveniences of the van, and the annoyances of his sisters. After he sneaks out and gets comfortable on the seat, he talks to Clyde over his walkie-talkie, and he asks who will be sitting next to him. After some thinking, Lincoln decides that Lenny can sit next to him, since she is usually dazed out for the entire trip. After convincing Lenny to sit next to him, Lincoln goes back into the van, only for Clyde to point out the oversight of who will sit behind him. Following some more thinking, Lincoln convinces Lisa to sit behind him, but only if she doesn't have to sit next to Luna. After speaking to Luna, she agrees to sit up front, so long as she isn't next to Lori. This leads to a chain of deals and agreements between Lincoln and his other sisters, as to who gets to sit next to who. After finally finalizing the secret van seating chart under his mattress, Lincoln goes back to the sweet spot to get some sleep, and ignores Clyde's next question. However, by this time, the girls have gotten suspicious of Lincoln's intent, and after discovering his seating chart, they confront him about it. Lisa calculates that Lincoln has deduced which seat is the best seat in the van, and has angled his sisters in the positions most favorable to him, much to Lincoln's outrage. Now that they all know about the sweet spot, they demand that they get to sit in it. A melee ensues between them in the car, waking up the entire neighborhood in the process, including Rita, who tells her kids to get back to bed, and not to go in the van until 7 a.m. The loud kids go back to their rooms, waiting impatiently for the clock to strike 7 o'clock. When the time comes, Lincoln and his sisters begin a mad dash to the van and have an even more violent and destructive brawl. By the time their parents call it to a halt, the van has been completely destroyed. As Lynn Sr. laments the loss of the van that once belonged to his father and grandfather, Rita orders the kids to go back inside and tells them that the trip is cancelled and that they're spending the weekend together on the couch until they learn to get along, much to everyone's chagrin. With Lincoln's sweet spot plan ending in a total bust. He states that in a big family like his, you can't control every little thing. That said, he knows of another sweet spot on the couch. He then races out of his bedroom to the living room for it, and probably his sisters as well. As the episode ends. I don't know who likes or hates this episode. So I'm just going to leave it be. So screw the sweet spot. And screw save the date. Note, to anyone who likes this episode from The Loud House. Please handle and tolerate my opinion. Anyways, power play with the Casa Grandes is 426,850,000 times better than the sweet spot. End of rant.